Hey guys, it is Ustas here back with another video. The 10 must have Google Chrome extensions, which you should have in your browser for better web experience. All these extensions can be simply downloaded or purchased from Google Chrome Web Extension Store as you know. So this web extensions works in different ways and all the extensions I added to my list has different functionalities and features. So here I bring you the 10 must have Google Chrome extensions, which will make your life and your web experience better. As all these web extensions differ in their basic functionality, I'm going to order all these things in alphabetical order. So, as usual, now let us step into the video. is out there. Dot tech domain has recently crossed 100,000 web registrations which includes all the top YouTubers in the world and even CES uses a dot tech domain extension. If you want a dot tech domain for you, go to get dot tech and use the coupon code ITSSTAS to grab your suitable domain for just $2.99 applicable for only a single year. To learn more, click the link in the video description. Now at first as per our alphabetical order, we have Colorzilla. Sounds familiar, I know. Color plus Godzilla gives Colorzilla, just old school max. So coming to this extension, this is just a simple use color picker extension which helps you pick colors from a website. Just think of a scenario, you are just surfing around the web and suddenly a color or a picture's color attracts your mind. Then what would you do generally? Yeah, save the picture to your system and you'll use it for a late reference but that's an old school technique. Instead you can use this colorzilla extension to just pick the color you want. This one's a simple to use extension, all you need to do is just click on the color picker icon and it will do the rest for you. Scroll over the pointer over the color you want and click to pick the color and it will be automatically stored to your clipboard. Using which you can paste it wherever you want and in case if you want to pick another color other than the previously picked color one then you can also pick it and you need not fear of losing the previous color because all your previously picked colors will be stored in a previous color picker history. Which will be safe there you can access it whenever you want and you can even copy the color code of the color which you picked earlier the main thing I missed to say in the past that this extension is heavily useful for web developers out there as an amateur web developer I use this very often to steal colors from other websites Jeez. the CSS color analyzer helps you to get all the CSS based color used in a web page and using which you can copy whatever color you want from the analyzed result so in addition to all these things it also has an inbuilt color palette from where you can choose a color and you can even get the code for the color it has web safe color patterns it has hue saturation color patterns and different color patterns from which you can choose a color and copy the color code whatever color code you want the extension leads you to a website that is an offline website which allows you to generate gradients uh, as a web developer i know the difficulty in generating gradients for a divider God complex so if you want to generate a gradient then you can go there and generate whatever gradient you want and you can even copy the CSS code and you can apply it in your CSS code for your website so that's all with this colorzilla extension moving on to the option section being a color picker it does not have that much of options for modification inside it but it has some options like adding a shortcut key for accessing the color picker and other things so that's it with this colorzilla if you want to pick colors wherever you go then just get this extension and use it and moving on to the second extension extension we have full page screen capture this is another simple to use extension which lets you capture the entire web page as an image yeah yeah, you, you may ask a reasonable question to me why do we need an extension to capture a web page why can't we use snipping tool and control plus print screen stuff in windows here's the answer for that question the main drawback of these two things, snipping tool and control plus print screen is that they let you capture only the portion of the web page which is present inside the windows section that is only within the monitor section. Just in case, think about this, what if the website has contents below the scroll bar? Then snipping tool won't help you to capture the web page, the complete web page. Even zooming out the web page and snipping it won't produce a high resolution image so you need to go for an extension like this to capture the entire web page of your system. All you need to do is just click on the little camera icon on the top and it will do the rest for you. It will capture the entire web page and it will produce an image with high resolution up to the mark and you can save it if you want. But this extension does have a serious drawback. While capturing some web pages it produces a break in the scroll section which 
which is an intolerable one. I hope this thing will be fixed in the upcoming updates and uh, apart from that this is best no modification options it is just going to capture your web page so it is simple to use and moving on to the third extension we have Horizon. at first when i downloaded this extension i thought that this one won't be that useful for me but then i realized that hmm, this one's got some serious stuff inside basically this lets you zoom an image once you hover your mouse cursor onto the image in other words if you move your mouse cursor into an image then it will be zoomed out i mean it will be zoomed in so that's how it works it works fine on all images and the zoomed image will be the best available resolution from the website so instead of opening an image uh, to by clicking on the preview to view the image you can just use this extension and you can hover your mouse cursor to view the image how it looks like you can even modify the zooming factor that is the level up to which you want to zoom the image inside the options menu this extension will be heavily useful one in shopping section where instead of visiting a product page to view the image of the product you can simply Go on the initial primary product shown at the home page to see how the product looks like. It saves you time and saves some of your energy in some time. So, but this extension uh, chokes at the point where the image is not actually a raw image. In case of uh, Instagram and other sites which embeds the image inside a web script, those images cannot be zoomed using this Google Zoom app. That's not this extension's bad because those websites use security feature to hide those images and to prevent intruders from stealing those images so that's those website security and uh, it does suffer at such parts but other than this it works fine moving on to the option section of this extension we have several simple and advanced modification the plugins disable of this extension is godlike in case if you move on to some sites like amazon where it actually has an inbuilt hover zoom option inside a products page but in case if you don't want that amazon's hover zoom plugin to be activated you can deactivate the plugin inside the plugin section because obviously that amazon's plugin will disable your hover zoom plugin so it also has a blacklist manager where you can add sites for which you do not want this hover zoom to be activated overall opinion this is a must have extension for your google chrome browser to make your web browsing and your day better and at fourth position we have the momentum this extension is a popular extension among the google chrome extension community and the basic functionality of this extension is that this enables you to redesign your boring google chrome new tab page into an awesome and amazing one this also acts as a personal dashboard for you with many contents and coolest background you can ever imagine just think about it every time you open your google chrome's new tab page what if you get an amazing look like this this will make your day a good one for sure it also lets you bring back your old school new tab page if you click on the link section and the chrome tab button you can also add some custom quick links uh, like the same google chrome new tab page and you can just click on it to view the page whatever you want apart from these things it also displays the current time and the weather of your location in addition to all these things it also provides a clear look just when you open a browser it shows the scenery with awesome quotes and amazing quotes at the bottom told by awesome persons great legends like nelson mandela and steve jobs or other legends it definitely makes your day a good one this extension can be either modified by opening the settings section given at the bottom or else just double clicking on whatever option you need will modify it. For instance, just double clicking on the time will change the time format from a 12 hour format to 24 hour format. So this is an easy to use, simple to use and a cool one. Till now, custom background option is not available in this extension but when you move on to the upgrade to pro section, that is the promise that custom backgrounds and other modification stuff will be added to this extension in the future level or in the future updates of this extension so hope for the best and let's wait for it and next at fifth position i think we have the one tab manager this is an organizer plus an optimizer extension which lets you organize tabs and to optimize your browser instead of having 30 web pages open as 30 separate tabs occupying huge memory you can use this one to organize all the tabs in a single tab or in a single window that's what it is many tabs into one tab Seven taps open and a single click on the filter icon at the top. Usually, extension icons will be displayed there. Clicking on the icon will compress all these tabs, and boom, there it goes a single tab with all the tabs 
A simple click will bring back whatever tab you want and the restore all will bring back all the tabs you have opened before. You can even group the tabs by naming them just in case if you have more than one tab group. Let's say you're having 7 separate tabs and 10 separate other tabs then you can group them by naming them. The tabs can also be dropped into one tab manager by just right clicking on the web page and clicking on the pop-up menus one tab sent to that stuff will send it to the one tab manager. This one's a simple to use extension and which helps you to reduce your confusion and memory concerns. Option. Moving on to the options section where you have so many modifications starting from simple to advanced stuffs to manage and modify the tabs. And moving next on to the next extension we have the panic button. Oh man, this one's a must have extension and the coolest I have ever seen. It looks little but it could even save your day. Just think about it, in a single click you can hide all your open tabs. Yes, just in a single click. Consider this good scenario. Uh, you are selecting a gift for your mom for Mother's Day which just passed a few days ago and gift. So it should be a surprising one. What if your mother suddenly walks into your room on seeing the sides open and besides she will definitely suspect that you are planning on some gift sentimental thingies. But in case if you don't want that to happen, just on a single click, ta da, all tabs gone. Now no one will get any clues about the gift and the suspense will be maintained forever. Clicking back on the panic button, just by clicking it, it will restore all the tabs. Even if you are working on some secret project, world saving project like Batman, then this one will help you to maintain your secret identity. Inside the options tab, it has some modifications or uh, simple modifications which will not be that advanced, like adding a shortcut key for hiding all the tabs or like adding a password man this one's a good one only the person who knows the password can open the hidden tabs by clicking on the panic button that is a really secure one and the other main thing is that you can even add a custom landing page or a custom redirect page because opening a new tab page and starting at a new tab page will definitely create suspicion for the person who is sitting near you get it this might even save your day in a good way or bad way if you know what i mean at seventh place we have the pocket this one is my all-time favorite extension and if you use this then it will be your favorite one too. It acts as a simple bookmarking extension for your browser but the main feature is that it is available for all the popular platforms out there like you can have it for Windows, you can have it for iOS or Android, whatever you want. You can sync your bookmarks with all the devices in your hand just in case if you are reading an article in a web and if you want to read the same article in your tablet then just pocket it and open the pocket tab in your tablet. You can open it and you can read it using Pocket app. You can even categorize the links by adding different tags for categorizing it. The Pocket extension redirects you to the enhanced website where after syncing or after adding your account you can view all the things which are stored in your pocket. The best thing here is that it automatically identifies the type of the link you stored inside your pocket. If it is an article then it will be displayed in the article section. In case if it is a web video then it will be displayed in the video section. Just simple categorization to organize all your things in just a single app or a single website. You can even filter the bookmarks using this option which makes bookmarks organization even simpler than ever. You can even add a link to your pocket manually just by right clicking on the site. This is free to use so just get it and you'll feel its necessity once you use it. And moving on to the next extension we have the strict overflow. This one is a real badass extension which makes you concentrate on a single thing. This helps the nerds and geeks how they like me to focus on a single thing while web surfing. Suppose if you are collecting notes for your next day's exam regarding nuclear physics and your brain always signals you to take a diversion from what you're doing right now. Puny brain does that all the time. Your inside thoughts conflicts like Facebook or nuclear physics, nuclear physics or Facebook, FB or NP, FB or NP. Obviously, Facebook means all the time. So, in case if you still want to be so sincere to concentrate on a single thing, then just use this extension, the strict overflow. It is basically a simple firewall extension with the timer in it. All you need to do is add the sites you want to block to the strict overflow section and damn you're blocked. It blocks all the sites once you click the tomato shaped timer icon on the top. Till the timer ends, you're not allowed to modify anything, you're not allowed to visit the site, you're not allowed to access the blocked sites. It keeps on blocking your beloved diversions. So be conscious while specifying the block time because you're not allowed to make any changes till the timer ends. In case if you want to urgently view a blocked site, then you can just restart the browser or you can just remove the extension from Google Chrome. Oops, that should not be revealed. 
But anyway, in case of urgency, do that. After the time urgency, you can enjoy the block sites. That's all the strict overflow extension. Helps you get good grades in your exams and to concentrate on your studies just in case. So if you want, if you still want this badass extension, just get it and use it. And moving on to the ninth extension, we have the Tunnel Bear. If you are a Linus Tech Tips fan, then definitely you should have heard of this very often. This one is a security extension for anonymous browsing. It is nothing but a VPN or a virtual private network which hides your identity in the web. Your IP address can be masked with another IP as soon as you choose your virtual location using this Tunnel Bear. Even websites with IP tracking facilities like IP Chicken and other sites can't track you if you're using this extension to activate this extension all you need to do is open a tunnel bear account with your email id and syncing that with your extension will make you a hidden person in the web the site has more reasons stating why you need to use a vpn this is not a completely free to use extension you're allowed to surf the web for free one little limit of one gigs and after that you are made to pay a sum of five bucks or something to continue your anonymous browsing in some countries some website like Tom will be banned for no reason even that can be viewed if you are using this VPN because you are on a virtual location with the virtual IP address you are a hidden person in this whole web there are hundreds of VPNs out there but I specifically trust this one so that's it with tunnel beer and moving on to the last but not the least thing we have the turn off lights extension Till now, Google Chrome doesn't have a night mode. Uh, I heard they are working on that stuff. But as an alternative, till that comes, you have the turn off lights extension. The main feature of this extension is not the night mode, but to give you a theatrical feel while watching YouTube videos and other videos in video streaming sites. Just a single click on the light bulb icon will highlight the playing video and it will blur out or black out the entire thing out of the video. It also works with all the sites, but it seems a lot more cooler for YouTube and other streaming sites. Inside the options section you can modify several things like adjusting the blackout opacity or even you can change the black filter to red or blue or green or whatever color you want. And you can even add a custom background with cool transitions just in case you want to view your videos in an interesting fashion. If you want a glowy look then you can even add a glow transition look and with a reflection type look but personally I hate that reflection. It also has several other options simple and advanced as other extensions. Moving on to the part we discussed before, the night mode. After activating the night mode, we get a toolbar to switch on and off night mode. The night mode as usual adds a background color of your own choice, usually black, and a foreground color of your own choice, that's usually white. So that's all with this turn off the lights extension and that is all with the top 10 or the 10 must have extensions for Google Chrome. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did so, just give me a thumbs up. Or else, just give me a thumbs down. Even Call of Duty and Find Warfare trailer is getting more thumbs down. But I do care for dislikes. So if you have any suggestions, just post it as comments or send a mail to helpitcases at gmail.com. And if you want to enjoy more videos like this, just stay subscribed or subscribe. And I will hopefully meet you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching and this is bye bye from my TSS stars. Bye.